Are you torn between moving to Ottawa from Toronto in order to purchase a home? Well, you're not alone. These are two of Canada's most amazing cities, but they offer very different lifestyles. In this video, we're diving into the key differences between Ottawa and Toronto from a home buyer's perspective. We'll talk about housing prices, work-life balance, fun things to do, cost of living, and overall lifestyle. By the end of it, I think you'll have a much better idea of where you might want to settle down. But let's kick things off with housing costs, because let's be real, it might be the most critical factor. In Toronto, you already know it's expensive. The average price for a home in September in Toronto came in at over $1.1 million, and in Ottawa it was only $685,000. That means the average home price in Ottawa is about 30 to 40% lower than in Toronto, and that's a pretty big difference. Buying a typical home in Toronto requires a yearly household income of more than $200,000, while in Ottawa, it's closer to $130,000. You can get a lot more house for your money here, whether you're looking for a cozy downtown condo or a beautiful suburban home with a backyard. If you're looking for affordability without sacrificing the perks of the city life, Ottawa might already be starting to sound pretty good. Next up, work-life balance. In Toronto, the hustle is real. It's fast paced, and with all the opportunities in finance, tech, media, and more, it's easy to get caught up in the long hours and stressful commutes. It's exciting, but let's face it, it can also be exhausting. Ottawa, on the other hand, has a much more laid back lifestyle. Sure, we've got a growing tech scene and plenty of government jobs, but here, people really value their time outside of work, and the commute for most people comes in around 30 minutes. You'll see folks heading home at a decent hour, taking the weekend to enjoy family time, or getting out into nature. If having a career and time to enjoy life is important to you, Ottawa has a great balance. And now you might be wondering about things to do because maybe you've heard that Ottawa is quite boring. Look, there's no denying it, Toronto is a world-class city. You've got everything from Raptors and Maple Leafs games to live music, theater, top-tier restaurants, and nightlife that never sleeps. It's the place to be if you want constant excitement. I'll be first to admit that Ottawa is not Toronto, but that's okay. Let me tell you the truth about our city. And after all, we are the capital of Canada. While Ottawa might not have the same level of 24-7 buzz, it certainly has its own charm. The city's perfect for if you're into outdoor adventure. Have you ever skated on the Rideau Canal in the winter? Or have you hiked the Gatineau Park just minutes from downtown? Plus, we've also got a ton of cultural gems, museums, galleries, and festivals. While Toronto might win on big city glitz, Ottawa is unbeatable if you love nature in a more relaxed place. Next on the list is cost of living. We all know Toronto is pricey. From rent to groceries to eating out, the cost of living in Toronto can be sky high. While it's definitely getting more expensive in Ottawa, it's still much more affordable. Transportation costs are lower, and you'll generally find that your money stretches further here, whether you're buying groceries, going out to dinner, or just living day to day. Finally, let's zoom out and look at the overall lifestyle. Toronto is a vibrant, diverse, fast-moving metropolis. It's the perfect place for someone to thrive in the middle of the action who loves the hustle and always is on the go. It's exciting for sure, but it can also be overwhelming. Ottawa is smaller, yes, but it's quieter, safer, and ideal for families or anyone looking for a bit more breathing room. We've got all the urban amenities you need, but with less of the stress. Plus, nature is right there, so you can easily escape to the mountains, rivers, trails, whenever you like and need to take a break from city life. So, why Ottawa? If you're after a more affordable lifestyle, a bit more balance, and access to nature without giving up the urban comforts, Ottawa can be really what you're looking for. It's a city where you can have a fulfilling career and still have time to enjoy life. You won't find yourself constantly battling traffic or paying way beyond your means to afford a home. For those of you who made it this far into the video, the reality is that Ottawa might not be a good place for you to move. Some of these factors may not be appealing for you, and that's okay. If you're considering making a move, or if you're curious to learn more about your options in Ottawa, I'd love to help you. Drop a comment or get in touch here. I'm here to help, and thanks for watching the video. We'll see you in the next one.